I'm starting to wish I hadn't shot that security guard. His willingness to run in front of gunfire would be real handy right about now. I tell him to run out there first, I run the other way, it would be perfect. Teamwork, the ultimate sacrifice. Okay, time to go out in style. Zigzag, zigzag. <laughs> <sighs> Is he gonna blow through the building? He doesn't have to. Personally, I would recommend he not blow through the building. I shouldn't even suggest that to him. Why is this door not moving? It's blown off the hinges! I can see its sides, for God's sake! This is not locked, this is cheating! Tell reality to stop cheating! Reality, how could you? So, let's face the facts. I don't have a grappling hook to climb up the building, and this tank needs seconds to turn the barrel left and right. So that's my window of really shitty opportunity. Hey, I'm not here right now. This is my day off, so don't- No. Okay, good. No second tank behind it. Oh yeah, what now, Captain boom -a -lot? How about you turn your gun towards me and kill yourself shooting the wall? I'm right here, asshole. Come get me. That's right, this side. Okay, bye. <laughs> Oh god. Don't be a noob. Don't be a noob. I, I can't handle a noob. Okay, I'm not blind and my face is still on my face, so that probably wasn't a noob. Ah! Look out! There's a sniper outside! I said look out! You need to be careful! Watch out or he can shoot you! Listen to me! I said there's a sniper! I tried to warn them. Actually, I thought that second guy was going to run into his own grenade, but I think he remembered about it at the last minute. Some people are destined for a special kind of greatness. Jesus Christ, this thing is loud. I can hear it outside the building. I'm gonna turn it off. Damn it, it's not. I hit the switch, what else am I supposed to do? I wouldn't make a good surgeon. Hey, I just realized I don't know how to fly a helicopter either. But I think I should get a free pass on that one because it's unreasonable to anticipate. Okay, I'm gonna let you live because I need you for an experiment to ascertain whether tank shells prefer blue or orange colors. Sir? Yes, that's good. You may call okay, me sir. why not? Didn't want to die alone anyway. Excellent. Okay, Chuckles, you wait there while I figure out where we're going. Okay, is this... No. Oh, you want to take a shot, huh? Hey, speaking of initiative, I can't help but notice you were standing up here while I was screaming for help downstairs. Some people might look poorly upon that. Oh, wow, grenades. I could have used these a few minutes ago. Guns. Shells. More guns. Holy crap, I've got to find Eddie. If I can haul all of this stuff out of here later, this is my ticket to a new life. Okay, I guess I can get this guard to help me carry some of this stuff. We should probably find a way out of here first so we can come back here with a truck. Yep, all that target range time is gonna pay off quick. Seriously, this might be a war zone, but there is money to be made here. I don't know how many MP5s I've seen just lying on the ground. We might need a couple trucks. That guard knew the code to this place. Maybe he knows other stashes just like this. He might just tell us. What does he have to I lose? I don't know if we should go any further. This doesn't look right. Eddie can interrogate him later if he doesn't, but one step at a time here. I'll just take what I can handle for now. I'll be using some of this just to get out of this madhouse. I don't have time to look through all these crates now. If it's anything like these shelves, we're going to cash out. Our luck has to change sooner or later. It already has. Don't you understand that? Forget it. All I need from you are the stash locations, okay? I'm not looking to split this share between anyone else besides Eddie anyway. I wonder if Eddie can even handle this much inventory. Fuck it. I know he'll try. I know Eddie. When I tell him about all I've found that's just lying here for the taking, he's going to get that sparkle in his eye. It's that same sparkle he had before going to Panama. And I remember how that turned out. Oh, I have not forgotten you. I mean, we haven't. I'm not really the sentimental type, but... Well, no, I'm not. Okay, this must be the sniper residence. I received a bullet delivery from you by mistake, so I'm returning it plus a little something extra for your trouble. Okay, I'll mark down that you received the shipment. Hey, you don't have a car, do you? That would make my life a lot easier. You have no idea. But you probably don't. It got blown up. This place is a lot bigger than I thought. Oh, so you don't know where you parked it, huh? Well, I can't blame you. 
If I knew where I was going, a few hundred people would be alive right now. But they were all assholes, so... Yeah... So what kind of car do you drive? I've been wanting to get a Crown Victoria from a police auction for some time now. I thought it would be cool to drive it around town with the police stripes, and splash some fake blood all over the hood. Now what is with these doors? Whoa! Don't turn into one of those people, man. Okay, guess we're going here. <sighs> I smell an ambush. We'd better be careful. Hey, I'm the leader. I need you to go find a camcorder. <gasps> then you can film me jumping around here and climbing on things. <sighs> if we're lucky, we'll catch some explosions or jets flying in the background. Then I'll mix some music to it later. It'll look sweet. Hey, you coming or what? If he thinks I'm waiting on him, he's in for a surprise. So this must be where that bomb hit. Why did they bomb this? It looks empty. Did they miss? Maybe they don't need a reason. Oh? They'll never think to look up! Yeah, try and advance on me from down there, surface dwellers! Today's forecast is sunny mixed with raining bullets. Huh, so was this building bombed before or after there were troops inside it? Me? I think it was after. Okay, how am I getting down? Uh, boop, ba, ba. I've lost track of how many friendly fire incidents I've seen the military commit by now, but a friendly bombing is a new one on me. And those are just the ones I've seen. So that means the actual number of friendly fire incidents is a lot higher. Anyone here? No? So what happened with that bomber pilot? Did he just sneak a flask of whiskey up in the cockpit and take off? Maybe he decided to do a barrel roll when he released the bomb so they would fan out everywhere. And why shouldn't he if he's drunk? Jesus Christ! I almost shot you! How'd that door open? Forget it. Don't spook me like that. You're really making me think about bringing back the kill everyone policy I had going on. Ah! <sighs> Okay, I think I know what we're gonna do here. I mean, I think I know what I'm going to do here. You just... I'll be happy to survive this with all my parts. Yeah, you do that. On a lighter note, I never told you the second part of my plan. The cop car is just the beginning. The next part would take a while because I would have to pay somebody to train a chimpanzee in hardcore karate and attack people on sight. <sighs> I mean, he would have to be loyal to me, of course, and the trainer, but everyone else would get a beatdown. <sighs> then we could ride around at night, and I could just let him loose on the street for a while, watching him beat the crap out of people. Nobody would be prepared for this. I could have a little whistle or something I could blow to get him to come back to the car. Hello, this is ground control! Please approach my signal! Do you see my signal? Let me try another one. How about now? Do you see that one? Hello? No, no. Please stay inside the aircraft until after you've landed. Thank you. Hold on, we're having some technical difficulty. I'll be right with you. Excuse me, sirs, sirs, you're not allowed back here. Thank you. Okay, you're gonna have to check these through customs. This is ground control again. You're flying south. Follow my signal. If you decide you want to keep on flying to another airfield, that's fine by me. Just keep going... somewhere. We're gonna need maintenance down here. We've got a problem with the hangar doors. Okay, you're heading back east. Oh, you're coming around. Okay, let's line it up then. Your approach looks good. I'm just gonna guide you in. Just follow my signal. Looking good. Ground temperatures are 88 degrees with clear skies. Thank you for flying with us. Those aircraft didn't have the best safety records anyway. I don't need to be checked by security. I work here. Thank you. Well, I didn't want to go in there anyway. <sighs> yep. Yeah, have shotgun, will travel. One thing I don't- ah! uh. Shit! Not again! Okay, walk away. I'm not getting involved any more than I am already. It's not like I can get in any more trouble. What do I care? I launched a missile. Besides, I fucking told him not to do that. So what does he do? He does it again. 
That's the story of humanity right there. He didn't even find a camcorder.